How y'all doing today? This is my wind, um, solar backup power system and wind generator part two by KVUSMC. And a little close up of the panels again. All right, let me show you about how it's all set up here. All right, let's go inside here. Right there, that orange cable that's coming out as my as my wind. Let me see here. My wind control input, actually output. Okay. And there's the cables right there, going to my solar. And going right there, and that's well, actually, actually, my yeah, going to my solar, going to the house, and that quarter there is my generator quarter where I hook up to recharge the batteries if I need to at night. We got power outages. Okay, let's go over here. Again, right here is where my wind generator cable is going to, and that goes right around there. And this is my cable is going to my my uh, inverter, my solar power. And here's where I got my battery, my wind power hooked up. Just like the manufacturer said, right there. Oh yeah. Uh, put that back. You know I've seen my battery before. But here's what we got going on now. 13.7 volts. Putting out 8 1.1 solar amps. And it is kicking. And it's cloudy outside, y'all, so really cloudy. Alright, here's my Madden Santa brother. I'm going to turn that on, y'all. Oh, yeah, you can hear it. This is one nice inverter. Okay, now we're going inside the house. I'm going to cut all the solar power on. You can use this for a backup system or all the time. I mean, your choice. Here's some burden. Okay. Let's go inside and turn everything on. Oh, but we need anyway. Alright. You can hear my panels again. There they are. Round cable, midnight solar box. All right, let's go to the house. That right there, my friends, is my my solar panel um, backup system and wind generator system where I plug my the charging batteries in if I need to with AC power or with my generator. Behind the EUI 2000i. Our electrician did a heck of a job. Alright, let's go in the house. There's my other little project I did back in the summer the hot tub. That thing doesn't burn all any electricity. I turned it down to about 65, and I turn it up when we got to use it. Oh, she's a nice one. 65 degrees. 
Oh yeah. But she's nice on the Sundance spot. Alright, let's go inside and show you my the setup here. Alright. Here we go. And y'all know who that is. That's my little baby bear. That's baby bear. That's Kinsley. She helped me design the solar project. Hi, honey. How you doing? Okay, now y'all, we're going to cut everything on. Here's my solar. Sorry about the lights. Oops, let's go back. This is my gen set right here and right here we'll cut what we want on it's a bridge right it's right down to the office on the line we'll just click it up and click it up do not we don't have any interruption in any of the power it's all solar now the kitchen the refrigerator your, your lights your essentials and right here tells you how many volts uh you're eating you know off of each uh, source. Now, if I turn my microwave on, you can see this bad boy jump up. Yeah. All right, here we go. That voltmeter. Look at that. See right there. She's up to about 1700 watts. 1600. And see, it just dropped. Okay, well, I can run the refrigerator, lights, everything you see here, TV, cable television. That's all solar power, y'all, and wind power. Kids is happy. So when the power goes out, and then when we just want to save money, we got electricity all the time. Isn't that right, Kinsley? See, so isn't that right? Okay, she's got a toy stone all over the place and she's watching Martha the dog. All right, my big catfish, I got to leave him out. A yeah, monster, 45 pound of blue cat. All right, let's go back. Anyway, here's the refrigerator working. As you see, it's full. Freezer just pumping out solar power. All solar power. All right, got lights, anything you need. All right, let's go back out of here, see what the solar system's doing now. Well, we're all running off solar right now. Only thing that's running right now is the heat pump and the hot water. And that's probably your, your main things, but during power outage, that's not concerning to me. I got gas, propane that is, to, to heat water up, we need hot water, that kind of stuff. We just gotta rough it out when you don't have power, but at least we have lights and computers, TVs. That's pretty good. Here's the garden. Yeah, thawed out soon enough. Brussels sprouts, broccoli, collard greens. It's been a worst winter we've had in about 10 years. But we'll go inside and I'll show you how everything is. Oh, let me slip and fill it in. <laughs> okay, the generator is kicking. I mean, the inverter. You hear that fan cutting on? And right now, we're putting out around 17 amps. 12.4 volts is what we're inverting. 12.5 is shifting. But it, you can hear it running. That's loud. <laughs> But 12.5 volts, 2.2 solar amps. Oh yeah, she's kicking. And this, and this is a cloudy day, y'all, so what can you expect? Let's go out here and look again. It's a windy, cloudy day in here in Virginia. A little bit of sun. I heard a panel, so I mean to say there's no... There's no sunshine at all, but they still put out a lot of a lot of power when we 
I mean, hey, ultraviolet rays are putting out the power. Anyway, y'all, y'all have a good one. All right, bye-bye.